Oh God, six daily. And them small sabare? I guess good luck with me and that. Oh my gosh, are these specifically for women? I just said adults, so I guess not. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm tired. I'm very tired. Today was my first official day working at the nursing home and honestly if this is how the days are structured and if this is the workload for each day then I'm really not complaining like it's way less than I thought it would be and I know that some days are gonna be like rough and like other days are gonna be a little bit more smooth depending on the residence that you're assigned to but so far I like it I'm off tomorrow and the next day and then I go back in the on the weekend which is pretty okay with me because here I get to work every other weekend so two weekends out of the month as opposed to every single weekend like I was working before and that just did not give any time for anything at all especially because being home on the weekends just feel really really different today I ate um, fruits that I bought I didn't bring any lunch with me because I already know that they offer lunch I had only bought two pairs of scrubs when I was doing the orientation so my friend is gonna go on the avenue today and I asked her to buy me an additional three pairs yeah so that I can have more than enough to change comfortably and this one I don't know I feel like it already looks I don't know but I really love the material because it's like nice and stretchy so I absolutely love that just now I went to Marshall's and I'm gonna in insert the clip here so you guys can see These are not worth standing in the line this long for, honestly. I was in the line trying to buy two items because some sports bra I seen on Target that I love and I'd want to buy. And I want to get some more t-shirt bra. So I went inside of Marshall's and I seen those two. And I'm just like, okay, I'll buy these. But gosh, when I went up to the line, that line was too long to stand in there for two items. So I was just like, no, 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 not doing this. And I think I stayed there for at least 10 minutes before I decided that this is not for me. I was just like, I can't. I honestly just cannot, okay? So I'm not like more tired than usual, but I am indeed tired. And I feel like I'm mainly tired because of the time that I wake up in the mornings because this morning I woke up at like 5 30 to make sure that I like had some breakfast and stuff like that to be there on time so I feel like it's more of like the time why I'm tired than the actual workload so I was standing in Marshall's and then I came out and I was just like okay the grocery store is right across there let me just go in there and get some fruits and stuff but it's so hard to go into the grocery store and just get fruit so I'm just like you know what I'm not gonna go in this grocery store either I'm gonna just go home so I went back across the street and caught the bus and like came off in like two or three stops I polished my my toes yesterday they're currently white white I can't even get up to show them to you guys so I polished them yesterday yesterday I was thinking about doing my nails but I really was not in the mood so I think I'm gonna do them either later on this evening or like tomorrow I'm going to just do the nail form again and I'm going to do them really, really short because there are no discrepancies against like nails or whatever. You can wear your nails. So I'm going to do them short so it's comfortable for me to work in, especially because you have to wear gloves. Every day I come home with gloves in my pocket. Today I just have one single one. Today was so smooth. Like I was done with my residence room really, really early and I probably had an unfair advantage because my friend who works there came up to help me but when she came I had the last two residents left so at that time I had already done four no I had one left actually I had already done four and I had the one left and she was just like all right well I'm here so let me just help you and so she helped me and that went by really really quickly and then for the rest of the day I was just chilling it was closer to 11 o'clock 
when I got done with all my residents and then I was in the day room for like um 30 minutes and then after the 30 minutes then I had to do the vital signs and stuff like that which was really really quickly and then record that and then I did the books and my day was pretty much done by like if I didn't have to like take lunch or whatever my day would have been done from 12 o'clock and so I really I like that I don't know if when I go back I'm gonna be on the same floor but every day when I go I have to check the schedule in the front of the building to see what floor is my scheduled floor but for the most part I feel really really good I feel like I don't feel as stressed out as when I was at my other job so I really can't complain I just stopped at the Dollar Tree too and I bought a bigger um notebook to keep with me in my pocket because today I had a lot of scribbling down on my book and I wished it was a little bit wider because it was more like skinny yeah like this so I got one that was like this wide this wide that still holds in the pocket on my scrubs and so I'm gonna be using that one instead to do all the little scribbling that I have to do daily and so I can make a checklist to check things off when I was done because today I found that that made it a lot easier just checking things off as I go along and like writing little notes beside the names so I know what I'm doing because that's how I function like I have to know what I'm doing and so um yeah I'm I really want to see if I can cook something because I'm hungry and I'm tired and then because since I ate breakfast I just ate um fruits and that did not and that was at two o'clock or like 1 30 ish and now it's 4 55 but the fruits only just wasn't enough to really hold me over for too long because I was hungry when I ate it so I'm gonna see if I can find something here to eat and if I can't find something then I'm definitely gonna make something and I'm gonna take these scrubs off I think I'm gonna make something and then I'm gonna shower but for right now I'm gonna like wash up my hands and stuff like that because I don't like cooking after I've showered it's not that big of a deal but I just don't like it but I wanted to just pop in and like record you know what my first day was like and I love it I feel like I shouldn't say that too quickly though because it's a little rough there <laughs> I don't know but I'm gonna find something to eat because I'm hungry hi guys so I put something a little bit more comfortable on and um this is the book that I bought at the Dollar Tree for a dollar when I was in Marshalls too I was looking to see if I could find a little book but I'm just like yeah I'm not gonna pay like 15 or 20 dollars or even five dollars in Marshalls for a tiny book like this because this is really what I want like this is the ideal size I'm not gonna pay that amount for a tiny book like this that I could get at Dollar Tree for a dollar and I've been taking these alive vitamins for three months now and the bottle that I had gotten originally it's finishing so I seen this one on Amazon that I wanted to buy especially because I'm gonna be working in a nursing home with older people and I want to make sure that I'm up on the vitamin side of things so I bought these ones it says max six daily I don't know if I'm I don't know what that means how many I'm supposed to be taking daily it says um fruits and veggies god is good let me see six capsules daily are you shitting me wow we're, adults take six capsules daily preferably with food no added iron well that would have been nice and it has nine, 90 capsules that's not gonna last very long at all so I, I need to get another one I want to make sure that I'm getting everything that my body needs to be able to function at its best because I feel like before I was never good with like vitamins and everything and I feel like we can both agree that since COVID really um, shook everybody up the vitamins that we've been having laying around for a hot little minute like we've had to take them and I feel like it's so crazy that it had to take um, something like that to show us how important these things really are like look but I'm pretty sure a lot of people can relate to me where you know you've just had the vitamins sitting there for a hot little minute like just not taking them gotta hate capsules I smell funny this is really gonna be a problem why do they smell like that oh god six daily and them smell so bad yes good luck with me and that oh my gosh are these specifically for women it just said adults so I guess not oh my god let me see what it has in there vitamin b12 which is really really good d c e k 
Okay. I really should take it, but six daily? Morning, noon, and night. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to walk with these in my pocket book. Like, oh, the requirements. Damn. Anyways, I'm about to go do what I said I was gonna do before I did this. I think I'm gonna make something really light right now because I really don't feel like doing the heavy cooking, honestly. So, I think I'm probably gonna make an egg sandwich. I think I'm also gonna take some chicken out, so I'll have that, um, ready to go for later on but for the most part i'm gonna just make an egg sandwich right now and eat that it's 505 and then about seven o'clock hopefully i have something else to eat if not we move okay 